So on that foundation for me and Dr. Balcom and Dr. Kim, we love you. We love you. That's why we're here. Headquarters already decided, based on the analysis our, our office did and the meetings we had with, with Jim and Spasse and the committee, and we had several meetings, and we went through a process of review of the possible development of this building, what it would cost and what would be the return, and whether we could have a church in here or how we could work it out. We went through that quite a bit, and we can share those, those you know, findings with you. But headquarters, the HSA board met, and it decided this property should be sold. And Dr. Kim absolutely said this property should be sold, and the Boston Church has to reinvest that money to really develop, because it's not, it's not happening the way it is. So I have to be honest with you. But... There's, a, there's something to understand too. Dr. Balcom showed three offers are on the table right now. But on top of that, why didn't we sign then? We didn't accept the offers. Why not? Because of you. Because we love you and we want to move together as one. Therefore, we're not going to make a move without really coming together in heart as one. We have to stay together. If you trust true parents, which you do by being here, Really, let's walk together and also follow the principle. If the central figure of this continent, the continental director, says and checks with mother and gets that kind of confirmation from heaven that we should move on, we have to be very careful, not just think headquarters, and be very careful. Because it's very easy to drum up negative feelings towards you know, this thing up there that seems to just be off in the wilderness. But this thing up there is not what we're talking. We're not talking about headquarters. We're talking about true mother, true father in heaven. We're talking about our central figure, Dr. Kim. And he made a decision. We should go forward and sell. And he's giving Dr. Balcom incredible fire. <laughs> incredible. Why you didn't move? Why are you afraid to tell the people? They won't move with true parents? They won't. They will. He said he defended. They will move with true parents. No matter what. So that's what I said too. Don't worry. True parents, family is one. We, we are one as true parents, brothers and sisters as a blessed central family. So that's why. That's why it's really a, a deep, deep issue. True parents, family that are united with true parents and with our blessed central families are united together. Do you stand with true parents? Do you stand with true parents? You're saying no. What are you saying no to? They're working on it. But I'm talking about the members who are staying with true parents. We're united. When I ask you if you're united with true parents, you say yes. Yeah, I believe you. That's what I mean. I'm, why, why did the board make a decision like that? Why did they make a decision like that without even a conversation with this community? Because I, I've been having the conversation. I've been having the conversations with this community. But hold on, let me finish. Let me finish. The conversation going on now. This is a conversation. going on now. The board, it's not right that the board would make a decision like that with totally disrespecting the people who came with Let's go.